Hi guys and welcome back to Electric Radiators Direct, the home of electric heating. Today we're giving you the lowdown on all things infrared panels, so stay tuned to find out what they are, how they're installed and how best to calculate your wattage. Be sure to give this video a like, hit that subscribe button and tap the notification bell for more of the same. Let's get started. Infrared panels are slim, flat electric heaters. Under their surface is a very tightly coiled heating element, which cleverly converts electricity into infrared warmth. Sitting flush against walls and ceilings, they provide discreet and efficient heating for a range of spaces. But what exactly is infrared warmth? Infrared panels work by releasing a type of radiation called infrared. This is an incredibly safe and natural form of heat. In fact, it's the same type of warmth that our bodies emit and absorb on a daily basis. Infrared warmth travels directly to objects in a wave. This includes furniture, pets and people. These objects absorb the heat and then re-radiate it back out into the room. Infrared panels use far infrared heat, which is the gentlest form of infrared. It warms on a deeper level and effectively heats across larger spaces, making it ideal as a primary heating source. So how efficient are they? Well, a big factor to consider when it comes to expense is efficiency, and there are a few ways infrared panels excel on this front. At point of use, infrared panels are 100% efficient. This means they transfer every watt of energy taken from the socket into usable heat without wasting anything through heating boilers, water, or pipes. By pairing them with a renewable energy source or a green energy supplier, they are totally efficient from start to finish. What's more, infrared heating is only concerned with warming surfaces rather than the full volume of air in a room, which means you don't have to worry about heat escaping to drafts and creating unnecessary waste. Plus, around 30% less wattage is required with infrared panels versus a typical convection heater. For every 10 watts a normal convection heater needs to function, an infrared panel only needs seven. All these factors combined guarantee that every penny spent is put to good use and there's never been a better time to keep an eye on that. Most infrared panels can be controlled either through a remote or through Wi-Fi. Each has its own unique benefits. Some units come with their control accessories in tow while some need to be purchased separately and this differs depending on the panel in question. Remote control is the more basic of the two. It works in the same way as your TV remote. If you're in range of the heater, you'll be able to manage it through point and press programming. Some remote controls are wall mounted, so they have to be operated from a permanent spot in a room. Other controllers are portable, so you can conveniently adjust your heater from the comfort of your chair. Remote controlled infrared panels don't need to be hardwired and are usually suitable for DIY installation. Wi-Fi control panels are the more convenient and advanced option. By downloading a compatible app, you can manage your unit from your smart device. Even if you're away from home, if you're connected to the internet, you're connected to your infrared panel. This will also give you access to a range of energy saving features, including weekly programming and voice control. When it comes to choosing the right type of control, it's worth asking yourself these questions. Is my controller built in or will it need to be purchased separately? Is it able to be DIY installed or will it need to be hardwired? And what kind of control is on offer? In-room remote control or smart Wi-Fi control through an app? Next up, we're looking at size and more accurately calculating the wattage needed to heat your space. First things first, you'll need to know what kind of house you're heating. If your house was built after 1980, has good insulation, including loft insulation, double glazed windows and cavity walls, then it's a new build. If it was built between 1930 and 1980 with good insulation and double glazing, it's a modern house. If your home was built pre-1930 with poor insulation and single glaze windows, it's considered an old house. So then you need to work out how big the room you're wanting to heat is. Measure your room's height, width, and length, times all three together, and then multiply all of that according to the key that's on screen. Let's say you're aiming to heat a room that's three meters wide, three meters tall, and three meters long, and you have a new build. We would times three by three by three first, so that's 27 meters cubed. This is the volume of your space. We then times that by 20, as it's a new build, equaling 540. Now that's how many watts you'll need to adequately heat this room. If you were heating this whole space with infrared panels, you'd need to make sure you hit that 540 watts mark, either through one heater or multiple heaters. 
And remember, it's always best to over spec than under spec. Finally, let's go over installation. Infrared panels are simple to install. There's no need to extend your plumbing or complicated retrofitting, and many can be plugged in for complete ease. If you're opting for wall or ceiling mounting, it's simply a case of mounting the panel and plugging it into a regular plug socket. You don't need a special kind of socket or high voltage current, just the standard ones already in your home are perfect. If you're planning on fitting multiple infrared heaters throughout your home, we always recommend getting them hardwired into your mains electricity by a qualified electrician. If you're installing in a bathroom, hardwiring is essential. So there we go, everything you could need to know before making an infrared panel purchase. Your journey to warm, healthy home heating is about to begin. Now's the fun part, deciding on design. At Electric Radiators Direct, we have a range of different styles to choose from, from canvas style units to mirrored panels ideal for bathrooms. Take a look at our website, electricradiatorsdirect.co.uk today. And don't forget to like this video, hit that subscribe button and tap the notification bell. Bye for now.